What's going on guys? Welcome back to Bearded Brad. We're out here on the beach today. Got old Salty over there with us. Say hi Salty. Hey Salty. <laughs> He's gonna come interfere in our intro over here. I just wanna do a quick little rundown of what we're using today. Salty's let me try out his new Temple Fork Outfitters. This is a 12 foot uh, heavy action rod. It's pretty sweet, been doing some casting on it. I got it paired up right now with the Pen Pursuit 3000. Uh, I'll probably end up putting a bigger rod on it if I do decide to buy one of these. That's just the only extra rod I had with me, so that's what we got. Next up, down the line. Next up, we got the Pen Prevail. This is the 10 foot. I got a Pen Battle 3 4000 paired up on it. I love this rod too, cast really good. Last but not least, one of my favorite setups that I'm using right now. This is the Star Stellar 9 foot medium rod. I got it paired up with the new Pen Battle 3. This is the DX version. Um, and this is the 2500. It's a great rod. You still cast pretty good with it, but it's super light. So any of those fish you're getting, you can really feel that fight on it. I do like this rod as well, taking it out to the jetty, stuff like that. It's a great all around setup. Uh, so I already got these rods out. We're using Salty's Papano rigs paired up with some fish gum. We're gonna see if we can't get on some Papano, but hope you all enjoy this video. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. All right guys, now that y'all know the rods and reels I use, we'll quickly go over the bait and the rigs that I use. These are Salty's Pompano rigs. They are handmade down here in Gold Shores, Alabama. You can pick these up at a lot of local tackle shops down on the Panhandle, or you can hit him up on Facebook or Instagram and buy them directly from him. The next we got Fish Gum. They are made over in Navarre, Florida. He's got multiple different colors and scents. Uh, this is good synthetic bait. You can fish with it by itself or you can pair it with some shrimp or some sand fleas or something like that. So if you're going out surf fishing, these two items are definitely a must have. All right guys, one more thing you gotta have when you're surf fishing is a weight. This is a Sputnik weight. I really like using these. This one's a four ounce. And when you cast it, it's gonna lock down in the sand. And then when you get a fish or you need to reel it in, these will flip back, pop open, and you can reel it in easily. Uh, but if it's rough out there, these are definitely a lifesaver. They are a little pricier. If you don't want to spend the money on these, you can just get a little pyramid weight like this. This one's just a two ounce, uh, but they're super cheap and you gotta have that at the end of your line to, to keep it down. So definitely gotta get some weights when you're in the tackle store, picking up some of your, your salties rigs or some fish gum. Go ahead and pick you up a couple weights also. All right, next up, we got the orange pompano rig, a little bit of sand fleas. We're gonna throw on some secret weapon fish gum. I like to just cut the pieces into triangles, like so. Throw it on here with these sand fleas. Oh, Fred hanging out back there this morning. First fish of the morning here. We got another rod set up and salty gelling at me. This thing just got whacked. Oh yeah, that feels like a good one too. That's definitely a pompano. Hopefully we can keep them on there. This is on a straight fish gum. Didn't even have a sand flea on this one. Yeah, definitely a pump. That's a pump for sure. All right. That didn't take long. We've been here maybe 10 minutes. Got the first fish. Needs a little spaz. Wild little dude. Not a big one, but he's a keeper. We'll go ahead and get him in the cooler. All right, guys, now we are out surf fishing. One of the things you've got to have is a sand spike. I use these from Beach Power Manufacturing. You can definitely get just a PVC pipe and cut it. But you're, got, you're definitely gonna want this to hold your rod. These go in super easy. You can stand on it like that, get it in the sand. It's not going nowhere. So these are definitely a must have. All right, just got baits back out. Already got something on. This is on that new Temple Fork rod, 12 footer. Oh yeah, that's definitely a pump right there. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. 
Let's see if we got a good one on here. It's swimming in with me now. Heck yeah. Pump number two of the morning. Yeah, this one's not not the biggest, but he'll eat. I'll check that out. Pretty little fish. All right, guys, we're gonna see if we can get us some more sand fleas. Sometimes when there's a lot of them, you can look down the beach. When those waves come up and they go back down, you'll see them all digging back down in the sand. I haven't seen any of that so far today. So if you don't see that, you can just go in and blind rake. Just wait on a wave to come up. Scoop there right at the wave. Get the sand out. Got one little guy. One little bit of color. There we go, there's a decent one. Another fish on here. Definitely a pump on this one too. Smells like a good one. Come on, baby. Ah! Dang it! It just popped off. Ah, no, it's tangled up. I thought it broke the leader, but it just tangled everything. I was gonna say maybe it was a Spanish or something, but all right, get some more bait, get her back out there. Get a couple more sand fleas on here. Green seems to be the color today. The green pompano rig. The green fish gum, green water, green shirt, green underwear. <laughs> Gotta remember the weight. Alright guys, hope y'all enjoyed that video. I am headed back to the house now. I'm gonna clean those fish up and cook them for lunch. Uh, but if you did enjoy that video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you like that content and want to see some more of that, make sure you are subscribed. Got a lot of stuff coming out this summer, so definitely hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. But again, I hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you all have a good weekend. And until next time, y'all take care. Hi right, guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Bearded Brad. <laughs> Back there with me. All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode. <laughs> Take three. Ah! Get him. Fish on. I'll jump cut. Make the fish be on. <laughs> ole, 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 ole. Surf Fishing 101, Sand Spike, Beach Power Manufacturing, 251-978-2953, call today. <laughs> I got some good stuff in here. Right now? Yeah. An hour and 45, I mean a minute and 45 seconds of me standing here doing nothing. That was pretty close, that's a minute and 50 and you said it a minute and 45, that's pretty close. <laughs> About a minute, 54, 55, 56, 57. You're on point. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I need a fish, I need a fish, I need a fish. Hey, 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 hey.